So, Corey here, there you go, right click on that block, Corey. Oh, you just jumped off again. Stop moving, now, now click on the block. And Damon, there you go, now you'll be able to click on that block and choose. Find some, find some points of interest, like I did, so like giant mountains or big trees or lakes, and use them. But you've got to use your starting location, so where's your starting block? All right, so use your starting block. And from there, how are you going to direct people around? Okay, so how are you going to direct people around? You need to be, you need to be finding your block, starting block. Okay, you need to work out how you're going to tell people where your treasure is hidden. Okay, I will give you treasure. When you are ready, I will give you treasure. All right. So from your, from your starting location, you need to draw your treasure map. What are you going to head towards? So you're at your starting location, Jamie? Yeah. What are you going to head towards? What's your first um, point? I'm scared. I don't know. The big dip in between the two trees. Okay, there are two trees. Okay. One white and one brown. Head to the middle. That. Yes, yes. So there are two trees, one white, one brown next to each other. Head towards them. That's your first step. Oh, I get it. Okay, that's all right. Do you know where your starting block is, Damon? Okay, so you need to be writing them down as you go. So if this is your starting point, what are you going to head towards? The trees. Those ones over there. These trees. So head towards the forest. Yeah. Okay. So head towards the forest. There's your first point. All right. What about you, Caitlin? Have you written down any points? You need to go back to your starting point. All right. So how do you get back to your starting point? Do you know the way back? No. No. All right. Well, I'm going to bring you back to the start start, and you can find your way from there. So who was that? Uh, Caitlin, so... Kate, there you go. So you're back here, it'll take... So right click on that block and find, you, find another starting point. Now from your starting point, you need to write down stuff. Yeah, that's right, don't worry about it. Head toward the forest. Okay, so head towards the forest. What's your next point gonna be? So take your way to the forest. Yep, what's your next point gonna be? You're writing down the points, go straight to the grey tree, turn left. All right. Okay. What are you doing, Briley? Do you know where your starting block is? What about you, Daniel? You're going good? Yeah. Do you know where your starting block is? No, I'll start you again. Okay. Corey, you're very dark there. Are you in a cave? All right, guys, if you're heading into a cave, you're going to need some torches. So I'll give everyone some torches. Who was I teleporting? Briley. To me. And I'm going to give everyone some torches. All right, I'm going to give you all 64 torches. Okay. Now, I'm going to turn on that you guys can now build. So if you're in a cave, if you're in a cave and you need some light, you can right-click with your torches and you'll be able to place the torches down for light. All right. Well done, Corey. Okay, so now, Briley, you need to click on that block and go to a starting location. So right click. That's it. Choose a starting point. Which one? Number two. So we write number two down here. Start point two. Now, what's the first thing that you're going to send them towards? Okay, so which tree? Pick a tree. How are you going to tell them which tree you want them to head towards? You could head to the sand on the hill if you wanted. That's just a thought. You don't have to. Or you could head to the white tree or um, turn around a bit further. There's heaps of white trees. You can't really do that, can you? All right, so find a landmark you can use to send them towards and then write that landmark down and follow your track. Okay. I've just been from the forest to the lake and I wrote that down. Head towards the forest and you see the big lake. Okay, what are you going to do with the big lake? What's the next step? I want some... Dirt. Yeah, it's because you've been digging. That's okay. How do you dig? We don't want you to dig yet. We just want you making a treasure map. Page. Like, uh, like a, a ditch or a, something like that. Head down the big ditch. You're lucky there's no monsters on today, Corey, or you might end up in a bit of trouble. Are you mapping yourself? 
Head to the cave next to the yellow flower. Okay, so you need to find yourself back to the start of the cave so that you can tell people which paths they need to take. All right, can you do that? Or do you want me to teleport you back and you'll start again? Well, you have to go down the hill. Okay, so yeah, head to the cave next to the yellow flower, down the hill. Yeah. Okay, so you need to be riding it as you go, guys. If you don't ride it as you go, you won't be able to find your way back. Yeah, press space bar, you'll go back up. Okay, so you need to be riding down your steps as you go so that you can follow, so well, so that I can follow the steps. Okay. Where do we get treasure? I will give you treasure. When you found the, the end point of your map, Alright, once you've found the end point of your little map, I will... How are we doing? Richard, you right? Yeah. Yep. I'm just teleporting myself around and having a look at some people. Corey, you're in the middle of a you cave. Oh. Alright, so do they know which way to go, Corey? Oh, here's the start out here, is it, Corey? The yellow flower cave. Awesome. Where's the starting block, Corey? Oh, okay, so you need to go down the hill and then into the cave. Now I'm with you. And then, yep, that's fine. And then where do they go in the cave? All right, so that's fine. If your treasure is going to be buried in the cave, not a problem. All right. I can teleport you back out. Yes, please. Do you know which starting station you were at? I was at this forest. No, which starting point were you? One, two, three. Oh, one. One. Okay, so I'm going to go to... Number one, and you'll start again, okay? So I'll teleport you to me at number one. Who am I teleporting, Jake? To me. Oh. All right, so Back. now you're... All right. How are we all doing? You only want to have three points? So you're ready to put your treasure down? Okay. What I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to I'm going to give you a treasure chest. Okay, so I'm going to give everyone a treasure chest. I'm going to make a heart. fine. Okay, so I'm going to give everyone one treasure chest. I can hide it in water. Okay, yes, you can hide it in water if that's what you want to do. The next thing I'm going to give you all, so to to place that chest down, you right click. Okay, and then you right click to open the chest. Okay, and I'm going to give each of you something really, really special to put in your chest. Okay. How can you put it in your chest? Sorry? Well, you need to put, place your chest down so you've dug a hole. Ah, scroll wheel or the numbers, guys, to change what, you're, what you've got in your hand. Okay, and then you... Place things down with right click. So if you want to put your chest down, right click with your chest in your hand. Yep. Yeah, yeah, well now if you if you punch it with your left mouse button, you'll pick it back up. So worked out where you want to put it, Shannon? If you want to dig that block, hold the button down. Okay, so if you want to dig block blocks, guys, hold the button down. If you want to break that again, so hold hold left button. That one, yep, Have left button. Okay, I'm coming, Jake. All right, and then escape. So you've put your diamond in your chest. Yeah. So now I should be able to follow your path to find your hidden chest. Awesome. So right click the chest. <laughs> yep. Now pick the diamond off your bar and put it up the top. Uh, yep, and now press can escape. No. Okay. E. Oh, or E, yes. So you've done your chest, you've done all your paths. Yep. All right. And Shannon, you've done yours, haven't you? <laughs> All right. So Shannon and Daniel. Oh no, we won't. We won't swap today. Yep. So guys, I don't want you to lose your treasure map. I will save this world. So we've got about four minutes left. So I need everyone to place their treasure down. They won't be able to open it if it's got a block on top of it. So I'd just put it wherever your path ends. This 
This is where it ends, right? In okay, here. so whack it in there somewhere if that's where you want to put it. Yeah. All right, so everyone needs to have their treasure buried and ready. All right, because next week, next week we are going to swap. So we're going to give everyone else a treasure map that we created. So we're going to give someone else a treasure map that we created. And we're going to get them to try and find our treasure.